Overseas now, the deadly plane crash in the Philippines. The plane carrying medical supplies going down just after takeoff in Manila. All eight people on board killed, including an American. Here's ABC's Julia McFarlane. Tonight, tragedy on the runway. A medical evacuation plane bursting into flames shortly after takeoff at a Manila airport in the Philippines. Huge pillars of smoke rising from the wreckage of the Lion Air plane. 8 p.m. local time, the plane was carrying three medical personnel, three crew members and two patients. All eight people were killed, an American and Canadian among the dead. In Sariate, Italy, this priest has the grim task of blessing dozens of coffins at a time. Families unable to bid a personal goodbye. At least 750 dying in the last day. A staggering 10,700 killed in the outbreak. Andrea Napoli is now recovering. I saw three people who didn't make it. Next to me, just the first night, a poor old man who at a certain point just remained still. Police in Spain enforcing the lockdown, checking people's papers. The death toll now at roughly 6,500, second only to Italy. And here in the UK, a new announcement that officials may insist the lockdown here continues until at least June, warning that life may not return to normal for six months. Tom? Timelines being extended all over the world tonight. All right, Julia, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.